Hello, Buzzer Girls, and welcome back to another episode of my Oxygen Not Included series. We are, as usual, still waiting for this geyser here to go dormant. Eventually, it will happen. But let's have a look around the base. Um, we're not researching anything, so let's find something up. At this point, uh, it's not that uh, important what it is. We will uh, research everything in the end. Um, we can also have a look at the uh, skills. So, yep, upgrade here towards uh, decorating. I think all the others are pretty maxed out, yes. Alright then. We have the Draco farm here with three Dracos in. Can't they jump this this gap? Looks like it, which means we will help them a bit. By doing this, the portal just sprung on and we get uh, arbor acorn that's great we will store that in this container um, seals are all the way down here yes all right we are making progress here with our um, Pufflet farm. Is it Pufflet? No, it's not Pufflet. It's. Um, let's have a look at the library. Pips! A pip farm. Uh, they eat wood and they produce dirt. So that's how we will get. A sustainable income of dirt. Then we have also been digging around here a bit. So let's do a bit more of that. Um, And let's have a look if we by any chance have discovered anything new out here. This is a is a hot steam vent. So we will make use of that one eventually. Over here we have a cold biome. So is how do we get over there? Either here from the top or in here we have hydrogen, which I would like to not get uh, letting out. So Let's do this and cross here where the uh, Epsilite is the strongest. Right. Mm -hmm. 
we do have chlorine here, which is not good. Uh, I hope it will sort itself out eventually. We can deconstruct this uh, ladder further. As eventually we will have uh, uh, normal farms down here. How are we looking? Here we have six hatches and here we have eight. So maybe in here we will have eventually lots of uh, a carbon dioxide um, maybe we shall move the door up here. Or even one one higher. this and dig out all this and then we can also put in the roof over there but what we will do on this side is We will have a bit of uh, of a uh, uh, gateway. Um, similar to what we have uh, down here if we uh, fill this if we can fill this gap with this water um, we can contain all the gases on this side from the gases on the other side and uh, thereby we can we do not need to worry uh, about the uh, carbon dioxide going into our base or we could even uh, dig in down here and uh, uh, continue with the uh, setup for the power but all in good time looks like uh, everybody is is busy now this has over pressure uh, because the water level has uh, reached uh, the bottom here but it's still not dormant so we still have to wait a bit longer and we have another hatch here and probably to reach the roof 
we need a few ladders. They go at it. picked up all right I think this helped so they only need to grow up and then they can actually produce uh, Phosphorite um, while feeding on the uh, mealwood down here. And we are nearly done with enclosing our base with isolation. Only this corner here is missing, but I guess this still will take a while um, until we have used up all the uh, water over here. And soon enough, once we uh, are done with our research, um, our need for water will drastically uh, be reduced. Right, that's the portal again. So let's see. Um, we need a doctor. Um, uh, operating that's not operating on uh, duplicates but on machines. So let's take the, the pop wool and go right ahead and attack it. That will give us quite a bit of uh, meat. Um, we will cancel that build for now. So we can uh, place a bottle emptier here. Then we can deconstruct this door. We will need the wall to go all the way up there. Uh, no use to have a water gate down here and all the uh, gases uh, can escape through the top. And we will put in water here and enable auto bottling, which means uh, they will not only empty uh, a swept up water, but they will fetch water from, from here. And we need quite a bit of, uh, of water in here because this water down here should then connect up through uh, this gap uh, to the wall up here. Nice. Um, then let's fill in a block here as well. Um, we have done the research and 
once again we are out of research topics so um, oh let's go from the top because at this point it does not meddle what we will do we can deconstruct this ladder put another block in here over on this side we're still digging on this side we're still digging oh the uh, bowls have hatched so let's attack those as well Because they will feed on the various things that are lying about and basically uh, produce solid blocks but half the amount so if we have lying around for example uh, this 860 kilogram of dirt they will produce a block of dirt but only of weight 430. So basically we are using, uh, we are losing uh, dirt in the process. And uh, later on we will, we will make use of, um, of voles because um, they are quite handy and aside from dirt they eat regolith um, and once we get to the to the top of the uh, asteroids uh, we will have an uh, abundance of that so that's basically a free meat farm only need a bit of work uh, getting the regolith to the volts. All right then, how are we looking? It is still just idle. That's not good enough. How much water do we have here? 400 kilograms we need 1,000 and uh, 1,000 kilogram of water that's basically one tile filled with water if it gets more it will spill over um, We can put in a wall on this side and then this will be uh, the farm. We have to be careful uh, so the, the arbor trees they grow I think three in height and they need one block on either side so we need to have a space of two uh, between them. For optimal growth. Alright, they deconstructed that door. So let's put in the wall. then we should be good to uh, 
to proceed with any of our topics. But I think that's good for now. So hope you enjoyed this, uh, this episode. And I will see you soon with another one. Goodbye.